The Apple iPad has become one of the most popular tablet devices since its release in April of last year, and almost one year on, Apple are preparing to launch the iPad 2. Many rumours of this new iPad have been floating around the internet, intensifying over the last month. One of the most rumoured and widely expected features to be included in the iPad 2G is the inclusion of two cameras. Firstly, a VGA front-facing camera to take advantage of Apple's video calling service FaceTime, which is now available with all iPhone 4's iPod Touches and Macs. So it really would be unbelievable if Apple were not to include this feature in the 2G, and we can be almost 100% sure it will be added. A rear-facing 5 megapixel camera is also being rumoured, and leaked cases have backed up this rumour that a rear-facing camera will be included with the iPad 2. Now the Retina display, featured in both the iPhone 4 and iPod Touch 4G, looks likely to be included with the new iPad, just to improve the fantastic apps and web browsing experience that you already get with the current iPad. This could really bump up the price slightly, but will make the iPad a million times better. Also being heavily rumoured for the iPad 2 is the inclusion of SD card slots to utilise expandable memory for the iPad and possibly even a micro USB port as an alternative charging option and to follow EU guidelines. These are two features missing from the current gen iPad and if they were included would add more balance to the argument that iPads are netbook replacements. Despite many rumours, reports and mock-ups suggesting the iPad 2 will adopt a new design reminiscent of the iPhone 4, however, the case leaks suggest otherwise and I predict that the iPad 2 will keep its current shape, but maybe slim down slightly to add portability and make it more lightweight. Now a faster processor and more RAM is a no-brainer, but this would just make the iPad even more snappier when using multi-touch and playing apps. We will most likely see the iPad 2 announced sometime in January 2011, with a possible release date of March-April that year. I do hope you've enjoyed my prediction video on the upcoming iPad 2G, and if you did, hit that thumbs up button below and subscribe for more. Thanks for watching.